Everybody, welcome to Northern Lion Tries Gut Whale. And I'm gonna tell you, in this video, you're gonna see a different side of me, quite literally. PC, usually I'm staring straight ahead. Nintendo Switch PS4, I'm staring in this direction. This is the rare, for my end, I know it's, I think it's left for you, yeah. For me, it's the rare right monitor game. It wasn't capturing well in OBS by direct video capture. This is stuff that you should not care about unless you're a streamer or a YouTuber, by the way. So I put it on display capture, which means I gotta go look at this monitor right here. So, you know, you might be like, NL looks a little different today. I promise you, same guy. This is no invasion of the body snatcher situation. Um, Gut Whale is a minimalistic roguelite that came out on Steam yesterday, two days ago by the time this video came out, uh, comes out. I did receive a code from the developers, thank you for that. The way I understand the game is that it is a roguelite about managing the space between you and your ammunition while you work your way through some kind of creature's digestive system. And you might be wondering, what does that mean, manage the space between each char uh, your, your character and your ammunition? I think, from what I can glean from the, the trailer, when you shoot an enemy, or anything, your bullet bounces, and then you can catch it. I don't know if catching it gives you a bonus, if it gets a combo meter going, if it just keeps you from losing the ammunition to begin with, but we're, we're gonna find out here, okay? Shall we? So I am playing as me in a few years. I'm just trying to figure out, because it's exclusively a keyboard-driven game. Whoa, the music. I'm trying to figure out uh, how we shoot. Z is how we shoot. Okay, let's get started. Hello. X is how we shoot. My mistake. Now, I believe that I, to the best of Oh my god, I'm so bad. Sorry. I haven't, uh, really used Z and X to, to shoot in a game. Oh, we have, literally, we only have that one bullet. That explains it then. Oh, okay, well, not a great start on my end there. Um, since, like, playing SNES games on the PC. There you go. Oh, it, hello? Oh, what? <laughs> okay, catch your bullet to keep your combo going. Let's, let's start over again. So there, there is a combo-driven system here. I'm just, a, I'm a fool. Don't, don't give me any hats here. I'm still trying to work it out. I'm gonna get you. So I never... That was so close. I never should have... Missed with a shot. We should always be hidden at all times because we only get so much ammo. Okay, I'm starting to get it. You know what this is? Right now? <laughs> It's just a grotesque super crate box. I'm starting to understand it. I'm starting to pick it up. You ate my bullet. You, but you, but you ate my bullet. A uh, heart is 40, shell is 25, bullet bowler is 60. You know what? I think I need to buy a shell, unfortunately, because I. I guess you just get one naturally. Um, which is very nice to hear, because to be honest, of course, uh, I was temporarily convinced that we were super dead. I see that the exclamation point, uh, points allow us to see where the enemies will be on the next floor as well. Very helpful, very useful, I'm dead, okay. I see, so respawning, you can't respawn endlessly, it's based on your HP. It makes perfect sense, and because I have two shells... I could actually shoot twice. Okay, so that's our combo. We got to 89. One of three. All right, I'm starting... Uh, that one is just embarrassing. That one just hurt. I'm starting to understand it a little bit more. I will say, in the original <clears throat> email pitch, I was told that was so bad. It's a little bit um, mechanically minimalistic compared to a lot of the games that I play on my channel. Not true. First off, don't get down on yourselves. I don't, I don't believe... I, I actually didn't think that I got killed there. That's my bad. I've played a lot, especially a roguelite. I'm not going to say the less mechanics, the better. But, oi, why would you go there? <laughs> the less mechanics, the easier it is for Northern Lion Tries. You know, it makes my life uh, 
a little bit simpler. I'm just waiting this one out. It makes my life a little bit simpler when there's a, you know, jump, shoot, and shop. That, that makes my life uh, very doable. I'm just going to be honest with you. I did not see the whale there. Yo, what about this? Okay, we're going to go down well strats. Look at that. They didn't expect the down well strats. I didn't expect the down well strats. Okay, we got two tools in the toolbox now. We got normal shooting. And we got down well strats. Down well strats. Very useful thus far. Really appreciate that you happen to get stuck on the architecture there. Made my life a lot easier. Hey, now there's a problem. You, we, we've created a, a problem there because we didn't have a bullet for ourselves. Look at that. Oh my god. Did you... I don't even want to know what my face looked like when I was dodging those shots. I, I have a feeling that it, it looked a little bit like um, pure despair. I'm realizing now you give money to this guy and maybe he unlocks something for you later. If you'll, oh, uh, so I've accidentally restarted the run. Um, that one's on me. I just wanted to lower the volume slightly. It is it's a little loud. And here's... There's a knock-on effect, okay? When I... Uh, have the game up slightly Ooh. no 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 when uh, I have the game up slightly too loud I start to shout when I start to shout may I Thank you. when I start to shout my voice gets fatigued when my voice gets fatigued at the end of the day that's no good for me give me a restart on that one I'm actually it was a blessing in disguise that no thank you well, we'll look at hats a little bit later. I want to master the game first before I worry about cosmetics that actually have mechanics attached to them as well. It was a blessing in disguise that we accidentally restarted that one game, because now when I make a single mistake that could be easily recovered from... How did I live at least that long, though? That was, that was stunning to me. Um, now when I make a single mistake, I can just give up on the run and plan for perfection in the future, instead of... Uh, Trying to persevere. Heart hat. Heart. Let's, just, let's buy a heart. I think that's acceptable right now. Okay, you're no problem. You're a slight problem. Oh, dude, the downwell strats! The downwell strats. This is it's ruthless, buddy. It's ruthless! Look, you see how quickly I died there? It took like two seconds. Oh my god, this is... 2020's most difficult game so far. And that includes Bannerlord trying to figure out how to enter a tournament live on the video for the first time ever. Okay, don't drop on top of enemies. Every run, here's my roguelite philosophy. I knew that was coming. If we can learn one new thing on every run, yes, we will buy. If we can learn one new thing on every run, Eventually, you're gonna get where you need to go. Very nice shooting! Can I have it, please? Thank you. So, what we're learning on this run is, uh... Do your darndest not to drop on top of enemies. Whoa! Why would I let him get... <laughs> I got genuinely frightened there. Oh, you dropped on top of the enemy! You don't have any bullets, you dummy! What are you gonna do? You don't have any bullets! Okay, you're doing okay. Head down. Can I can I purchase a heart? It costs 120. We cannot purchase a heart. In fact, we get God hat. Yo, I'm realizing the hats are actually like not cosmetics, which is something I should have realized earlier. Free 100% point increase. Okay, that's. I mean, that's okay. I'm dead. Let's check out some of these hats. <laughs> Take me back to the lobby here. This seems very interesting so far. I'm, I'm calling it right now. If you like down well. Strong calves, it's me. I've often described my physique. Two tree trunks shoved into a lumpy potato. So I have no idea what strong calves means. Probably higher jumps. But if you like down well. Another stylish yet not quite as terrifying, minimalistic roguelite. This seems like it might be right up your alley. Um, I think we just go. Free 50% point increase? Why not? I re okay, we do respawn with a bullet. That's what I was worried about. So we might as well, when we reach like the end of a, a quote-unquote biome, 
we might as well spend all of our shells. That one, that hurt. I didn't realize there was a piece of architecture in the way. We're free. Oh! We're still free. I need the bullets. Thank you. Dude, you guys are toasted. Yo, is this the first? No, no, it's the second time I've made it through the second biome. It's a new era, baby. So we might as well eat both of those in there because we get another shell anyway. We cannot afford the god hat. Let's, let's double our multiplier then. Or double our points. Okay, you are a scary creature. We're free. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Stab me? Man who was stabbed? You're a creature, huh? Yo, we know that you can beat this level. What words of words of encouragement here? I had come you're right. You're absolutely right. I know what you're gonna say. NL, you'd forgotten about downwell strats. I had briefly allowed downwell strats to slip my mind. You're free. You're free. And the damage is free. You cannot stop me. Incredible look. I want to see what happens to that frog. I don't know if we're gonna get there. Like if we're gonna if we're gonna be able to shoot 35 more bullets of that frog. I'm definitely dead. Um huge hit. That was a big one. These guys, they're so frustrating. <laughs> Why would you drop on top of the jellyfish? It just doesn't make sense. But I am, you know, I'm getting better bit by bit. And I'm enjoying myself a great deal, actually. I mean, if you've watched... I really thought we were kings there. Send them, send them. We, uh, if you've watched... Uh... Yeah, let's get that. Mario Maker for any length of time, you know that I'm, well, not immune to frustration. I am pretty resilient to frustration. In fact, I am perhaps not cut from the same cloth as people that are into, like, super massacre games. But, uh, you know, I, I'm one of those weirdos who at least derives a little bit of pleasure from being frustrated. Um, and I, I don't know where that comes from. Probably a deep-seated self-esteem issue. Either way... Um, this is, this is tickling my fancy. And you know, can I be honest with you? Oh, tighten up the whales on level three, please. I, if I'm being honest with you, um, my number one complaint, that would have been a heartbreaker. My number one complaint about, uh, roguelites on Northern Lion tries is not a lack of mechanic is not a lack of mechanical complexity. It's rather that I think that sometimes they shoehorn in too many mechanics um, and, and they don't play to the strengths, which, which is maybe like accessibility. This is, uh, although difficult, also accessible, you know? It, it mechanically minimalistic enough that you know what's... Who? Let me get my bullet, please. Mechanically um, minimalistic enough that you know pretty early on um, what you're doing and and where the pressure point is for improving and you're not like the kiss of death for me For a, uh, a roguelite for northern lion tries and I, we can't even afford it. So we'll just double up here is um, The run is going well, but I just do not care because of the fact that I'm, I'm just not engaged So like the worst thing for a northern lion tries of a roguelite. Let's, let's distill it down to brass tacks it is not um, too few mechanics, or let's put it even more simply, a roguelite where you die so quickly. Instead, it's a roguelite where you live for a long time, but do not care. That's the kiss of death. I would rather have, you know, 10 runs that take a minute each, but all of them feel like kind of catching lightning in a bottle, um, than have... And we, we will buy this because I'm embarrassed of myself. Downwell strats are, are failing me. It's not the strats fault. It's my fault. Yes, I knew as soon as we whiffed on that one, that was going to cost us our lives. I'm embarrassed. 
Anyway, I think I've said I've said my piece on that. You get it. You know what? Let's just go with a full restart on this one. I it, it, sure. More risk, more points. Why not? I want to at least have one decent run. You know. That's an embarrassment. I, and really, like I, I know that probably spoken ad nauseum about it already over the course of this video but I, I actually think that you know you can draw some similarities between this and uh, holdout which I played yesterday which is that they're both mechanically oh you don't get a you start with one heart as this guy okay I understand um, mechanically they're very simple very easy to understand at, at first glance um, and I actually, I like that a lot. I, I don't really like arcade games, so to speak. You know, like, I, if you're like, hey, do you want to play Joust? I'm like, no thank. However, if you're like, hey, we've got a roguelite, and it's inspired by Joust-style mechanics, now you're speaking my language. Okay, I mean, why wouldn't we? Just double our points here. Get, go 50% higher on points. I have been killed. Give me another retry here. I, I, I wonder if we could buy a heart first. And it, I don't, like, I don't know if it works like heart containers do in something like The Binding of Isaac. It feels so weird to say The Binding of Isaac. It's like I'm mad at it. I'm referring to it by its, its full legal name. Did you see that incredible play? Look at that. Combo meter through the freaking roof. Can we? We absolutely can. Thank God we did. Alright. <laughs> I'm embarrassed. Ah! That well, you turned me into a real YouTuber on that one. How dare you? Whoop! Yeah, honestly, like, again, this shouldn't matter to you unless you're a uh a streamer or a YouTuber. My only real complaint about the game is that it doesn't capture and window capture. It happens from time to time. But I'll tell you, it's almost like it's an implicit positive, you know, because uh, it, it's an accidental compliment is a good way to describe it, I guess. Because normally when a game doesn't capture and window capture, I go, eh, I'm out. To have a game not capture and window capture, and I'm still like, you know what, <laughs> you know what, this looks interesting enough that I'm gonna um, still give it a try. It's complimentary. I, I, but I wanted the bullet. I just wanted my bullet back. <clears throat> I just, wa I just wanted to receive my bullet. Is that such a crime? We're gonna get there. I know you're like, you haven't had one good run yet. I don't know. Maybe we have. Maybe we have. Maybe we have it. Why would you jump into the whale? That's the thing I just have to ask my, my human brain. Is like, of all the things you could have done there, jumping into the whale seems quite dubious. Excuse me, sir. I need my bullet. Thank you. Oh, my lord. I've been outsmarted by the most basic enemy in the game. I got robbed by an old lady on a motorized cart. And I didn't even see it coming. Good shot. There you go. No, no jellyfish. Not here. Incredible work. Good stuff. That's a perfect performance. You've already eaten my bullet, I hope, because I can't get over there. Buy me a heart, please. I need this. You're destroyed, dude. We're crushing it now. Like, I mean, I guess that's... You pretty much own... What a shot. I didn't think he could make it up there. I think it's very clear that we should be not using this right here. Let's go with nothing special. Dude, um, you're only gonna die to downwell strats. But yeah, I mean, the other thing is... I always talk about, like, meta stuff in Northern Lion Tries. Like, instead of listening to how I... What I say about a game... You should listen to what I say about a game a little, at least. But instead, like, observe... 
me playing it. And this is kind of like the classic example right now. The mechanics of the game have been on display since like our third run. And yet I'm still playing it. Which should indicate to you that I'm having a good time. Because to be honest, we're playing more than is necessary. Missing that bullet was huge. We're playing more than is necessary, perhaps even more than is prudent, to understand what's happening here. So we need to purchase a heart here, that much is for certain. And yet we are still alive. To, to beat the third level one time, that's all I'm asking for. I hate when I drop the bullet. Ah! <laughs> when I drop the bullet right on top of like where an enemy's about to spawn, that's that's the, the difference maker. Psychologically that burns me up inside. No iframes as well, or very few iframes when you respawn is uh hilarious to me. And I, I don't mean hilarious in the like you just gotta laugh. I mean it's actually it leads to comical moments. Okay. Let's not buy hearts here. I think if we're going to make this work, we're going to need to be a little spendy. So, we'll just... Just kill me. We're going to give this one more try. <laughs> but I actually quite like this. It's also... Uh, it's appropriately priced. It's five bucks. Which, uh... You know, the, the irony is... You know what? Just kill me again. The irony is I've played a lot of like, you know, $20, $30 games on Northern Lion Tries that I think can justify the price point because they are, you know, perhaps aesthetically they look a little bit more robust or mechanically they got more going on. But you know what? Just kill me. For my money, I think that um, you, could, you could get a lot more out of a $5 minimalistic roguelite like this. Than a $30 mediocre game that seems like it's got more going on. But then again, you gotta you gotta ask yourself, where do you fall on the on the spectrum of uh, how similar to the streamer am I? I am almost exclusively mechanics driven. So a game that is pure mechanics is always gonna hit me a little a little better than uh, than it'll hit some other people. Like, if you're watching this right now, and you're like, what's the story? I, I almost ascended there. Which is wrong. I should be trying to descend. I really thought he was going to rise slightly faster, but that's okay. Who don't get hit, baby! What are you supposed to do? Anyway, I like this a lot. This is Gut Whale. It's available on Steam. I'll put a link in the video description, of course. You know, thank you for the developer for sending me the code. If you want to pick it up, you can pick it up. It's cheap. It's minimalistic. It's fun. I guarantee you can beat my high score. On top of that, um, if you like what you see, but maybe you don't want to pick it up right away, you can always wishlist it. I'm sure it would make the devs day. Apart from that, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click the like button. Helps out a great deal. Subscribe. We're hurtling towards some awesome subscriber milestones. We may well hit that Super Smash Brothers video milestone this week. My, I'm getting my ABS system prepared and I'll be in the comments saying thank you or like, why would you say that? I went over to ask about the rules. For now, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. See ya.